are one thing and all yeah. that, but uh, what, what really tells you the picture, you know, you factor in hang time, directional putting, all those types of things that we ask our guys to do. So uh, there are a lot of challenges that punters go through. And, uh, you know, but I think also in Sunday night's a great example. Uh, the punter from uh, New England did a great job. This plus 50 punting, that's a big, big part of being a successful football team. And uh, they were playing great defense that night. So those two things really, uh, I think, help contribute to their victory. And, uh, yeah, those are little things that don't always show up in the stat column. But, yeah, when you go through tape and have a chance to watch a guy, that really, uh, really is helpful. So would you prefer not to have two punters on scholarship, or does it matter? Is that something? Because it used to be you'd have 130 scholarships and punters. Would you That'd be, be great to have no punters on scholarship. <laughs> not, to, not to pick on punters, but. Uh, it's changed. Uh, I mean, the, it has. Yeah, it has. It's, it's something you just have to. I think consider, I, I really uh, told this to, to people, young boys, you know, get these guys punting the ball because uh, it's really kind of a lost art. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, nobody really doesn't seem to want to grow up being a punter now, uh, other than maybe Australians, I guess, you know, and they're smarter <laughs> than we are. Uh, but that and a deep snapper, you know, Casey Kreider might play till he's 50. Uh, you know, realistically, you know, he takes care of himself and he's really good at it. And they're not allowed to hit those guys. so. That's a really good position, but it is kind of a lost art. Uh, I'm not saying kickers, good kickers, are easy to find, uh, but I think with, with the popularity of soccer, it's probably a little bit more of a natural transition, whereas uh, punters are really, you know, they're becoming more and uh, I think more and more hard, hard to find or challenging to find. And, um, you know, it's just, it's not something that people really gravitate towards for whatever reason. Is it harder to get them to walk on these days? I mean, in the old days, it seemed like they mostly did that. Yeah, yes and no. Okay. Uh, I think you can go two routes there. You know, there are, are a group that are going to be recruited uh, as scholarship players, and then uh, the other route maybe would be a developmental uh, type punter. And think about Dave Bradley, who was really mm -hmm. a high school quarterback, right? But a good athlete, and a lot of times, uh, you know, the best punters I've seen were pretty good athletes in their own right. And think about Reggie Roby, right? Probably would have been yeah. all, all Big Ten in about four sports. And in football, maybe all Big Ten in about four positions. But I think he made the right decision focusing on punting.